Hello everyone and welcome back to another Harrowby United fixture. Today it is Harrowby United versus Hullwell Sports. Obviously Harrowby United in the blue and Hullwell Sports in the green. And we finally get underway with the referee's whistle. And immediately it is Harrowby United to kick off. And as you can see already trying to make a charge up the field. And a Hullwell Sports player clears that into the stands. And although it may look like a beautiful day for, uh, for football, the pitch is quite wet. It has been raining uh, on the walk here, so the pitch might be a little bit slippery. I think you can probably see the, uh, the shine over the, uh, over the grass as well. Referee gives an early foul there. But I don't assume we will see a card just yet. So I'm going to apologise in advance if the camera starts to go a little bit wobbly. My tripod, bro my tripod broke. Uh, one of the legs is not properly attached. It snapped, but uh, it's basically just on its side now. So it's not actually properly connected. So I need to uh, look into that. At the moment, though, we have a Howell Sports player down and also a Harrowby player down after a bit of a clash. Harrowby are in, a, are in a really good place for the playoffs as they are currently sitting, I think it's fourth in the table or fifth. I'm not exactly too sure. And more to the point, I don't actually know where whole world sports are. But if that is the, uh, if, if that is the case, then Harrowby are in an opportunity to, uh, to go up at the end of the season. Ball comes into the middle there. Elliot King tries to get a, a foot on it, but I think there was a foul in the middle of all of that. Probably we're doing a pretty good job there at um, getting the interception from a goal kick from a header. Foul well, there. There was an instant screaming pain there. Yeah. 
and as we just wait for uh, them to get back on their feet. And we can finally now get back underway. And that is another Harvey United winner on the head. Number 11 here tries to make a counter attack, but blocked by one of the uh, one of the Howell players. And he tries a lifted cross to the number 10, but just overestimates it. I think there might have actually been an infringement in the middle of that. Cross comes in, but picks up by the keeper. Oh, he spilled it a little bit, but managed to recover. Trying to make another attack there. There was slight deflection there, but keeper was still equal to it. And I think that's the first goal kick or kick from the keeper that Hull will have actually been able to keep it. Number six there with some great skill. Let's set the number 10 through. The keeper is called offside for it. Just a bit too eager to try and have try and have a go there. Goes back to the keeper. And that was offside there. Famous last words, the keeper had it, co had it covered. Not the first time around, but... It wasn't headed for the goal anyway.
Tripping on the left there, crosses it in. Number 10, one on one with the keeper, just goes to the left. I think there was a slight moment where I think uh, there were supporters in the stadium that were ready to cheer, but um, they will have to uh, delay that, I hope. Number 11 tries to the number 10, but then tries to complete the one two, but isn't able to. And there might be a free kick in this. We have seen some uh, ambitious shots here from, from Gurney just too far out. And it is going to, need to take it. There was a header in the middle, but it wasn't on target. How well sports throw in here? there. Oh well sports win it back. through here to have a shot and when there was a shot there in the middle I think by the number 11 but again just too far to the left there's the number eight Apologies if you can't see anything right now, the sun has kind of disappeared. Oh, we'll throw in here. Yes, 
Oh, yeah. release yourself! Come on! Number 10 could be through there, but he's tackled down but called offside anyway. Communication there. The referee blew the whistle, but it was actually to to call something. He's about two yards away from where it was. I swear he just put it in the same place that it was took from. As the sun comes back out. Beat him! Beat him! <laughs> we have a corner to come. Another corner. Remember the last, um, last Harrowby game I videoed? I scored a few from corners, not that time around though. Could be through here, but it's called offside. Hey, that's too easy! Lazy! Come on! We have another spectator on the word of a pigeon. It's flying around me. Hmm? It's a pigeon. That's what I said. It's actually got a nest up there. Seems to have a bit of a nest up here. Cross comes in once again. Number eight still has it. Number six tries a shot, and it's just gone to the left of the keeper there. I think number ten probably has to got a tap in. Just to the left of the keeper. It looked like an easy save. From the keeper, but then... Next thing I know, the, the ball kept rolling. 1-0 to Harrowby. Get the ball back! Get the ball back! 
Hamilton has another shot there and it's already 2-0. Only about like a minute after we had the last one. And that is now 2-0. Great start for Harabi. Can they just run away with this now? About 30 seconds. 30 seconds, not even a minute, half of a minute. Two goals in very quick succession there. And this could be great for Harvey in the playoffs if they get to that stage. They should get to that stage by the way they're playing right now, but uh, obviously this is only against one team, it's not against the entire league, is it? Number four kind of tagged the leg there a little bit. Just a bit too late. Went through the legs of the number 11 there. Bohowo still managed to keep it. And that's gone off there. And then watch him run back to where it was. Told you. That goes off there for a Harvey for him. Oh well, throw in here. Jesse, Jesse, if Jack Irvin goes beyond and Harrison drops into the back three, you come and do Harrison's defense, yeah? This way! This way! Cross comes in for Howell. Can they get a header on it? No. Howell player there hit the hit the fence. Think they're okay though. How are we throwing there? Oh, my 
And Reservin tries to run in with it. Goes back to Gurney. He tries a shot from distance. Just blocked though. Back to the keeper, has a little bit of a slip there. Free kick for Holwell. Ball comes in. Caught for something in the middle there. Not really too sure what, but. Holwell still looking for their first goal. Number two gets the cross in. Oh, King with a header there, just hit the ground first and then just went over the goal. Corner though. So maybe the keeper got a touch on it. I think King did get a header on it, but not enough to put it on target. Oh, 
streak of Harvey Thrones right now. Number eight though, could be through here. Number 11, tries a shot, but just deflected. Off for a corner. Needed clearance. It's not going to be a Harvey throw in here, Off there for another corner. comes in but the keeper manages to punch it out. And the keeper manages to uh, safely catch that one. strange one to call as a free kick there, if I'm going to be completely honest. I mean, it did kind of... Yeah, I, th I think that's why it was called, so I can agree with it on that behalf, but...
Rabbi be throwing her? it back, crosses in, the number 10 gets another chance, and again just to the left, but a good run there earlier from the number 7, John Smith. Smith and Ryan just to keep it on there. This goes over. Corner. to keep it out of there. The keeper's gone down though. has a shot there but a good save from the keeper to keep it out. Very close to going in. There is a whole world player down there at the moment. Thank <laughs> you. 
I think I'll be through here, but oh well, player there, able to slide in and steal it away. Number 11 here crosses it in. Another good save though from the keeper to keep it out. Bit of shirt tugging there. Runs across in, but again, another good save from the keeper though, just to keep it out. Another corner. Too much parry away, but it's gone to a heavy player, and yeah, it hit the number seven hand there. I think that was good, quite a clear handball there, to be fair. As we are heading into injury time, we'll see how much the uh, ref decides to add on. I'm going to suggest maybe like three, four minutes. Get one back just before half time. A shot there though, but it's way over. Bomber! 
into the box. Blair brought down there, but the ref says no penalty. Oh, well, management trying to uh, ask the ref why that wasn't a penalty. Probably. Ten runs with that. Number eleven though tries a shot from distance, but isn't able to convert it. And I think this might be the final kick of the, the final kick of the game, maybe. And the ref finally calls the end of the first half there with Harvey leading 2 0. Welcome to the second half between Harvey United and Howell Sports. Just a bit of a refresher. Harvey are still leading this contest, this contest currently 2 0. Let's see if they will be able to extend their lead or if Howell will be able to claw this back. Surprised that none of that was called as a um, was called as a foul. To be honest, how are we throwing though? Pass! Pass! Marcy! 
Well there. Could probably start an attack here if they're a bit patient. Still through the number eight, 16 here on the left. Crossed in, but a good block there from the Harvey defender. You do have a player down though. Back up on his feet though. Shot there, but it's just gone over. <clears throat> Goal kick for Harrowby. Yeah. Yeah. 
Substitution for Harvey, the number 14 is going to be coming on, replacing the number 6. Sports throw in here. <laughs> Number seven crosses it in. Oh well, player Go, though. Managing to get the header. Taz, if he goes. Second! Second! Good headed clearance there for Harvey to and I think he just hit the ball into his face, I think. Harvey player there. Come on! But the Harvey keeper still makes the save, regardless, or makes the catch. Clearance there for Harvey, but it's still going to be a whole world story. Oh, and is that going to be a goal there for Holwell? It's going to be offside anyway. Go, 
Just to the right of the keeper, into the bottom left corner. We haven't put two passes together yet. No, we don't. We're walking through the fire. We go again. Leo, come on, we go again. We go again. Two touch, three touch. Move the ball. Don't be in a rush to get this. Referee isn't happy with the placement of that one. Yeah, we'll take out. Come on, 
free space in the middle. Yeah? It's, not, it's not from the boys the first long job. There for Harvey with some great shielding there. Block there though from the heavy player. Throw in to come. No, 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 no corner, not throw in. I knew as soon as I said that I said the wrong thing. Did with a good punch there. Start a run here. And you can hear the cheers from the stand. The number 11 tries to cross it in to find King on the edge of the box, but loses the ball unfortunately. King though with another shot, but saved by the keeper. Back him up, back him up, John. Back him up, go on then, outside. Outside, go on, go on, you leave that. Number seven crosses it in, tries to find the head but isn't able to. Number eight with a shot there. Have a shot, Jesse! But again, just cleared out. Come on, Jesse! Come on, Jesse! Come on, Jesse! Get behind the ball! Good work, you two! Come on, Jesse! Come on, Jesse! Great work, you two! I think the keeper there for Harvey manages to just pick that one up. Keep 
Another substitution, the number 10 is coming off, and the number 12 is coming on. down the right hand side and I think that has gone off. I think it's still a throw in though. I think if they do, and he gets a yellow card for that as well. It's more of like an orange card because of the uh, sun. It kind of changed it a little bit. Someone's car alarm is going off. Off there for a Harabi throw in. Another substitution, I think. Number 17 is coming on. For the number 11, I think. Thank <laughs> you. 
There was a shot there, but it's taken the keeper, but it was offside anyway. What we got, Lara, please? Can we have a sub, can we have a sub, please? Pete, sub. Another substitution for Harpy, the number 15 is coming on for the number 2. There for a whole well throw in. Going to the right hand side, crossed in, but not enough to uh, find someone in the box. And we have got about 15 minutes remaining now. It's looking like it's going to be another three points for Harabi, one point for each goal that they have currently. We should hopefully help them in their charge for the playoffs. A clash of two players there. I think it might have been a head bump. The Harabi one came off worse, unfortunately. 
Well, any player, it comes off worse for his unfortunate. Oh, the um, player actually got a um, a black eye from it by the looks of it. That's not good. Well, I hope he uh, hope he gets better soon. could be through here. Tries a shot, but I don't know who they were trying to find, but it certainly wasn't the goal. Good. 
time and then we go into injury time it is looking like a a sign still delivery win for uh, for Harabi Number 12 could have been through for a shot there, but... Wasn't able to. goal there. I don't think any of us were expecting a shot like that but just came out of nowhere and uh, makes it 4-0 to Harabi. Go 
And Hotwell could be through here. Number 15 tries to go to the inside. Feeds it through with a the shot there. Oh, just to the left though. As we now go into injury time, I'm guessing probably again another like three, four minutes to be added on. I'm glad that the weather is uh, quite so, it's actually quite warm uh, in the sun. And it's now more mid afternoon ish and the sun is a bit low. I am still wearing a coat, but I, I can feel the sun. It's actually quite, you know, it's quite pleasant, you know. Glad that there's no rain in sight. I mean, there are a few dark clouds, but. Toby, go front tails, go front tails. Toby, you've got a front tail. Come on, right shoulder. Five, five. Good job. 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 Good Number 12 with a goal there. 5 0 now. Green run, pretty sure. In injury time. In injury time. I think we literally only have like a minute left to play. It's going to be an excellent result for Harabi to really show their performance if they get to the playoffs, which they should do with this performance. Three more points to help them in the table. <laughs> they still want to get more goals. Another shot there. Really close, but just too far to the right. 
And I assume this will probably be the last kick of the game. deciding to call this yet. One more chance to make it 6-0. Just over though. <laughs> Goal kick. There's a foul there in the um, in the back there, and I'm pretty sure there's going to be a yellow card that's going to be produced after this. I don't actually know what was, what actually happened. Watch the fan, I want to be called as soon as um, this is taken. Watch it, watch it, watch it. And I told you, and that is a win for Harrowby, 5-0. And a clean sheet as well, very good results.